this is um, reservoir. I think it is called the Huanguji Reservoir because this is the Huanguji River. Anyway, it's really, really, really high because we've had rain. It's the rainy season. It's a lot of water, a lot of runoff, a lot of extra water here. All right, I'm out looking for geocaches around the reservoir here. I think there are five. We'll see. Maybe there are six. But uh, let's get going. All right, this is the head of the trail. It goes around the reservoir. My guess is, I haven't checked. I didn't do much research on this before I came out here. I just wanted to get on the bike and come. Uh, my guess is the geocaches are along the trail here. Uh, the first geocache I found was this little, this little nano in the, in the skirt of that post there. All right, let's get going. This is a, a beef restaurant. They, they specialize in Korean beef. They probably have their own cows out here somewhere. And they made their own mailbox. Upyon. Upyon ham. This is the sign for the restaurant next to a red pepper field. And there is a geocache under it. I was just going to pack it up and go home, but I'm kind of having a good time. Walking around, it's not raining, it's windy, but that's nice. Temperature is probably no more than 76, 77, something like that. So it's a perfect day for walking around. And look at that. There's a little vegetable stand out here in the middle of nowhere. Alright, let's keep going here. Yongot is lotus, lotus flower. Huh, this is a lotus flower field. And as I've said in other videos, I think, you can eat the roots of the lotus plant. It's very tasty. You can make a little, like a little dessert out of it. You, um, it's some kind of sh syrupy thing you can put on it, and it makes it a nice dessert too. The lotus roots. If you're up for it, I like it. Okay, that says Nurigil, and that's the name of this road, it's, and it's also the name of the cash series Nurigil one through something I'm not sure how many there are total um, the word Nuri there are two two words Nuri Nuri one Nuri is hail I don't think that's it the other Nuri means world the world so probably the world road out here in the middle out here in the middle of the Korean countryside Could mean something else. I don't. I don't know. Possible. Something that geocaching in Korea is not particularly known for, and that's uh, the cleverness of their hides. But uh, this one, uh, this one uh, deviates from the usual. There we have a, uh, just a, uh, um, a stump, kind of, sticking out of the ground. Nobody would know that inside that is a little nano cache. Anyway, this is the uh, clever little cache. And the log sheet's in there. Pretty cool. I was mistaken. The log sheet is not in there. It's deceptive looking. And that doesn't come out. I think the log sheet is gone. All right, well, what I've done, this does not come out. I have some rudimentary tools in my bag here, but this does not come out. 
This does come out, but it is simply a top. There's, it's just like a cap, like a little bottle cap. That's all it is. So, definitely there is no log sheet here. I assume this is the cache though. I, I, it's, I mean, what, what else could it be? Was that the right coordinates? And it looks like a cache. So I do have, I do have some log sheets. So I'll, I'll put one in. chest high by the 26th of July. I'm just kidding. Rice doesn't grow that tall. Rice is a type of grass. And it's really good and delicious. Good for you too. The cache is under one of those benches, I can almost guarantee it. But the guy sitting in his car is keeping a close eye on me. And those two are probably going to watch whatever I do. So that cache I'm not even going to try for because it'll get muggled. Alright, that's everything. I found all but one and then this one I'm not even attempting. So. What's that? I found five, did I? Yeah, maybe. Five, I think. That's good. And it was good to get out on the bike. Get out of the house. Um, the humidity is rising. The temperature is going up a little bit. So I think this little spell is going to end tomorrow. We're probably going to be back to sunny, hot, and humid. And then uh, by the mid-afternoon, there will be storms again and heavy rain. That's the usual. All right, well, I just interrupted some fishermen with my loud talking. It scared all the fish away, I think. Sorry, guys. <laughs> anyway, um, that's my little geocaching adventure for today. Thanks for watching.